I'm Natish Bassona outside Sheridan Mall where it's the scene of the city's latest murder. I just want to show you a memorial growing here for the victim. Police have identified him and City News has learned that today would have been his 33rd birthday. Balloons and candles filled the spot where John Trevor Paul used to hang out with his friends. They were meant for him to celebrate his birthday. Instead, they are now placed as part of an on-site vigil to remember his life. The Toronto man was fatally shot outside the north parking lot of Sheridan Mall in the Jane and Wilson area just before 8 p.m. on Friday night. Officers found the victim badly injured, lying on the ground with a single bullet wound to the chest. He was taken on an emergency hospital run but later died from his injuries. It's a tragic loss for this community who described him as a good person, a loving father of three, and someone who was always willing to help. Is the fact that he was able to put a smile on my face. You know, like, you can be going through whatever you're going through, but when you approach this gentleman, like, you would smile. Yeah, I know him all my life. We go to school together from primary school. And I come to Canada and I get to meet him here again. And he's a man that have a lot of influence, basically. Police say it's still early in their investigation and don't know if the victim was targeted. Um, it's too soon to say that has not been communicated to me as to whether or not it was in fact targeted. I do know, according to the investigators, that the victim was on scene and he was there just hanging out with a group of friends listening to music prior to this incident happening. Police did, however, confirm that they are looking for four suspects and released these security camera images of three of them fleeing the scene in a light-colored, full-size pickup truck with a moonroof. The fourth suspect is believed to be the driver. They're asking anyone with information to contact 31 Division or to give a tip anonymously by calling or texting Crime Stoppers. This isn't the first time this has happened at this mall. Another shooting took place just a month ago that claimed the life of 22-year-old Jovane Clark. It's not known if the two incidents are related. Now, the memorial continues to grow here as friends and families and loved ones just gather to pay their respects for John Trevor Paul. He is Toronto's 43rd homicide of the year. Mr. Spasono, City News.